Hello everyone, so today I'll be sharing with you how you can connect to the Windows Server through another virtual machine. So it could be a Kali machine or, or it could be a Windows machine. So for today's demonstration, I will use a Kali machine and try to connect to a Windows Server. So first thing you should do is that to check your settings to make sure that the network is being set uh, correctly. So as you can see here, my under my network, I put net network means that it's able to accept an outbound connection to the host machine and tap into the internet device. So same thing goes for your Windows Server. It should be the same kind of setting as well. So you can see here, net network. Okay, so now once they are able to share the same network, we can now begin to try to connect to each other. So when I say a simple connection, it's just to able to ping each other, then that's all. Okay, so first of all, you have to identify what is the IP address for both devices. So to find out the IP address of a Kali machine, you do an IF config. You can see here, the IP address is 10.0.2.14. So let's find out what is the IP address for the Windows machine. So instead of a IF config, you do an IP config. So you can see here, it is a 10.0.2.15. So right now from your Kali machine, you try to ping to a Windows Server. Okay, so what you can do now is to try to ping the Windows Server from your Kali machine. So you can do a pin dot zero point two point fifteen. So as you can see here, now there's no response. Now even after like a while, you realize that there's no response. It could only mean that the Windows firewall is blocking this uh, Kali machine. So if it's not able to detect the machine at all, it will be able to receive some response saying that request timeout or host unreachable. So in this case, that since there's no response, it could mean that the firewall is blocking it. So to prove my point, let's go back to the Windows server. You type control panel. Then next you go to system and security, then you go to Windows Firewall, then you turn Windows Firewall off, you turn off Windows Firewall. So turn both off, then click OK. As you can see here, now Kali machine is able to ping to this Windows server. And the firewall is designed to stop another machine from ping to another uh, Windows machine. Okay. So what can you do to connect to this uh, Windows Server uh, when the firewall is on? Because you trust this device, you trust Kali Linux, and you don't trust other uh, devices. So what you can do is to set inbound rules. So how can you do that? Now first, you can actually turn it on, turn it back on, so you can OK. So once you turn it on, now it's not able to uh, connect again. So you just close the connection first. So then we try to ping again. So now there's no response. So what you can do is that you go to advanced settings. Then you go to inbound rules. Then you click on the new rules at the side panel. Then you go click on custom rules. All programs, yes. Then you want to, you want this rule to apply to all kinds of protocol. Then you go to which remote IP address that this rule apply to. You click on these IP addresses. So you key in the client's IP address, which is 10.0.2.14. Then you click OK. Then just click Next. So you allow the connection. So you click next and next and you just put a remote computer and that's it so you can see from the from, from the Kali machine it's able to ping to the windows server even though the firewall is on so one thing to note is that Make sure that your IP addresses are in the same network range. So, for example, you can see here this is a 
10.0.2.14 and this is a uh, 10.0.2.50 so it's in the same network range so if either one is for it start off with like 192 or something then these two no matter how you configure it won't be able to connect each other because it's not in the same network range so since now both are in the same network range and you have allowed this machine to connect to this uh, windows server then this will work okay so that's all for my show tutorial so if you like this video i appreciate if you can like this uh, video and subscribe to my channel and i will see you in the next video